welcome back to my channel welcome to a new vlog um i'm not sure how long this is going to go up for this is going to go i'm just going to vlog until i think there's enough footage up preferably up to friday because i'm planning to do a declutter with me on the weekend because my room is what a tip two i've got so much stuff and i just need to i just want to go through it and figure out what i need to keep and what I need to get rid of. So, welcome to a new weekly vlog. I'm going to vlog. I'm only prepared to vlog partly because I'm working from home for the first three days of the week. Mm. Partly because at the beginning of last week my mum got COVID and so I had to I had to work from home anyway because I've been in contact with someone who's got COVID and now I've got COVID. So I'm hoping it's going to be gone by Tuesday, Wednesday. So that I can go back into the office on Thursday but it's a likelihood is if it's not gone by then I might have to wait till the week after to go back to the office so I thought I'd vlog it anyway obviously we won't be able to vlog as much whilst I'm at home working from home because whilst I'm at home the phone still can ring at any random times so if I was talking to a camera the phone rang that would be a bit awkward but I'm still be able to vlog a bit more look at my lunch breaks and stuff because I'm home and I don't have anything else to do so yeah but i'm currently sitting here watching the vampire Diaries. i decided to re-watch it i'm on episode seven of season one because i just was like i really missed the vampire Diaries. so i'm re-watching it i'm buying i'm having a break my tiktok break um i'm really just getting some content ideas because i'm trying to like become a bit more of a book talker that sounds really bad i hate that word um <clears throat> but yeah absolutely i'm getting some book talk ideas i want to post because i really want to do some of them so I'm planning to get some ideas today and then tomorrow I might film some of them because I feel fine I've got Covid basically as I said I feel fine though it is Saturday the 6th of August by the way um and it's like five o'clock and I did film a 24 hour reading vlog until about an hour and a half ago when I decided to stop no actually about an hour ago but um yeah i feel fine i don't feel ill i just feel bunged up so tomorrow i really want to have like kind of a content day i want to edit the reading vlog i want to film some tiktoks i need to try and get a photo and a dress so i'm gonna because my mom is negative now i'm gonna try and see if she'll be willing to take this like a little tree outside my um my flat and i just think it'll be a cute way to get this picture of this dress that i got gifted so i'm gonna see if she'd be happy to do that for me tomorrow if I can be bothered to put makeup on, it's a question. And yeah, um, but right now I'm just chilling. I'm editing the reading vlog, watching my videos, TikTok stuff, you know, all that. Okay, it is quarter past seven. I had my moment of sitting on TikTok for about an hour, um, but I'm good now. I've got a few. <laughs> I've got a few, I've been in my pyjamas all day, please don't judge me, but couldn't be bothered to get dressed, they wasn't going anywhere. Um, I've got a few things on my, four, four, currently, well, I say four things on my list of film, plus one video, two videos in my drafts to upload, um, on my TikTok, so six basically. Um, and at the moment I'll come up with some more ideas over time obviously but that's I feel pretty good um, what was I thinking of but yeah so this evening I'm going to try and do some more sort of actual getting on stuff editing of the, of the 24 hour reading vlog um, watch the vampire days just chill good morning it is Sunday the 7th of August, it is currently 10 to 11 and I've been up for a few couple of hours, I'm still positive, I took a test this morning but it's a very faint line so I think it's kind of going so that's good to hear. Um, I also feel a lot better today, like I genuinely don't feel blocked up, I've got um, a little bit of a soft right but it's not as bad so I just, I just feel like my energy is a little bit drained so like, I'm going to take it easy, I'm going to take naps when I need to today because I am back at work tomorrow from home but still um yeah so i'm just gonna edit the vlog i've got some tiktoks that i want to film um i want to i do want to take that photo with the dress this afternoon so we're gonna see how i feel and hopefully like, it won't take that long unless she's just going out in the corner 
in my um, garden, not my garden, but my, um, oh, what's the word? The front of my flat, basically. Um, but yeah, I think I'm just going to put vampire dyes on in the background and get on with some editing and just chilling. I was going to write some of my story, but I don't think I'm going to that today. Okay, it's half past 12. I've done a few TikToks in my draft. I haven't completed the ones on my list yet. I've done, but I've done a few other ones that weren't on my list and I'm really happy with them so far. I uploaded one of them because I'm really happy with it. So, yeah, I've just ordered lunch because I've got three bagels in the fridge and I kind of need to save that for my lunch as well so I'm not home for the next three days. Um, so I've got an order of lunch today and order some chicken because it's from this place in my gate that I've never ordered from. So, fingers crossed it's good. <coughs> But yeah, I've done some editing of the video, so I feel like I've had a productive morning. Um, I'm currently just watching Danny's house, but I will put that on a little bit later. It's needed a break from it, to be honest. I say that I've only watched one episode today, but yeah. Okay, it is two o'clock. I feel like I've been super productive today. I actually was going to take a nap earlier. I took about two minutes of it and then was like, no, you need to toilet and I just got up and woke up. And I've done so much. I've done some TikToks. I still need to do a couple more of the ones that are on my list I want to get done so I'm going to do that in a moment I think um actually no I'm not going to phone does need charging so I'm going to turn my phone for a bit edit the vlog the video whatever you want to call it um I'm currently watching Destiny Sid Wells Rena for 24 hours again video um I'm about to go to my favourite episode of Vampire Diaries season 1 so um I'm not sure if I'm ready for that <laughs> But yeah, as you can see, I did my makeup because I just did my photo shoot outside and actually the pictures are stunning. Like, I love them. Um, and this is because I got gifted that dress for, from Chi Chi Clothing. Um, and I feel like I need to, um, not feel like I need to take a photo of it. And I could have waited to do it because I didn't email them saying I've got COVID so I don't know when it's going to get done. But because I'm fine, I'm just I'm going to do it. So I'm going to edit that now and post that, I think. And yeah, I'm just in a very productive mode today and I'm really happy about it because I have to work tomorrow and I have to work from home. And I'm, I know I'm vlogging it, but I'm oh, not vlogging it, vlogging it, but you know what I mean? Like, I'm, I always mind about having to leave the house early to get to work, but... Being in the office is just so much more like, I feel like I'm actually doing work, I'm here at home doing it and I just don't really like it. Like it is easier for me in some ways and like I understand why people prefer working from home but I just prefer being in the office. It feels because I'm around people and I prefer that but it's fine. So I'm just going to get on with some stuff and I will hopefully chat to you later on. Okay, I am going, I don't know why I started this one, I'm trying to put you on here now. Okay, okay, okay. Hello. It's a lot later now. It's like 10 to 9. 10 to 9? No, it's not. It's 10 to 10. I'm about to put the vampire dive back on. I've kind of just been chilling for the last few hours, but doing absolutely nothing. I've done a lot of TikTok content today, not gonna lie. I've started a series. I haven't posted yet, but any of them yet, but like front of house steward rants because I've been doing that for a long time. And I just got a few videos, like loads of videos in my drafts and my TikToks ready to go live. And I'm ready for it. It's really wobbling. But now I am going to read. I'm actually going to read some of both books I think tonight. Or at least mainly this one. Because I really want to, for a video, read the Girl, the Girl Online trilogy. Because um, I can read them very quickly and I think I might try and do it for a weekend. I might even try and do it next weekend maybe um instead of doing a declut with me because we all know that's not going to happen yet so at some point i've just got a lot and i don't want to have, i don't want to, have to do it in september and october time because there's loads of stuff happening in september and october time but i actually have a very exciting vlog that i'm planning to do in october because i'm doing musical con and joyful Luke gage's concert in one weekend in october so i'm planning to film that but it's fine, and I need to make sure I put most of my money from this month and September into my savings, like make sure I don't spend it on crap. Um, so, it's the plan. But anyway, I really need to use the toilet. I'm going to read some of my book and watch some of the Vampire Diaries because I want to get further into this. I'm not 
exactly excited for work tomorrow, but I'm glad I don't have to leave the house. Good morning. It is quarter past eight, Monday, the 8th of August. Um, I've been up since like technically since 10 to 7 when I took another COVID test, and it's really annoying because I feel completely fine, but it's still coming up positive, but with a very, 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 very faint line. So fingers crossed tomorrow it will be negative because I really need I need two negative tests before I can go back to work and I really want to go back to, well, into the office to work and like, I can still work from home but I really want to go back into the office because I'm getting really bored of being in this room at home and I'm really getting really bored of working from home. Um, so, like, I was even considering calling my manager up this morning to say that I can't, I can't work today, but I'm not going to do that because I need the money, so. Um, but, yes, I'm not really awake right now, I'm quite tired. Um, everything is set up apart from my laptop's not on yet, I need to turn it on, but I will do that. later on tonight tonight no in like 15 minutes yeah i'm gonna turn it on at like 5 p.m when i finish um i need to go clean my teeth in a bit my mouth really hurts um i need to go fill my water bottle up but my setup i will show you is this is the monitor obviously oh my god why is this so dirty Okay, I really need to get like, one of those cross to clean this because this is ridiculous. But this is my monitor. Then I have the phone next to it. And then my work laptop. And then a cup of coffee. That's an old can from last week. I actually got five bought. I've got some cans in the fridge because I've got, I don't know why, but I've got a recent love for Coke Zero. Don't know why. And then I have my book on here because. And yes, I have read this before. I am annotating it as why, as mentioned. So. Um, because I don't really need to pay much attention to reading it um, but I do at the same point I kind of have that here just in case there's no emails to do at work and, or I just want to take a mini break um, because I have no one to talk to except myself and then this will be filled up with water because I talk a lot on the phone so I need to keep hydrated and my obviously annotating stuff are here and then my TV which will be playing the Vampire Diaries or The Office I don't know yet but I am actually going to chill. I bought, so I bought a little treat for myself for Saturday evening because I feel like this week has been, by all my plans for last week was like basically cancelled, like Adam's family, that's my friend. And I feel a bit disheartened and down. And I have no rehearsals this week because I'm not needed. So I've not been any stage stuff. I went to see Millennials last Wednesday, which, okay, yeah, I kind of, yeah, that was a good kind of end to the full time. But I put tickets to see Heather's because I want to see Ben Caron as JD before, I don't know if he's leaving in September, I know Elsa is, um, but I don't know if he's leaving and I want to see him in it before he does maybe leave. And if he doesn't leave then great, but uh, yeah, I just want to see it. And I want to see there's a few people I want to see in it, so I'm very excited I've got that booked for Saturday. Um, I... Bought £50 tickets because I got £30 off the ticket, so I'm excited. But anyway, I'm gonna drink my coffee, kind of just chill, finish this YouTube video, and then chill for a bit until work starts. So bring it on. Okay, it is five past eleven on my first lunch break. It's been a bit, it's not been busy, busy, but it's been busy, if that makes sense. I've been at work for two hours now, I've got five hours left which isn't actually that bad but it still feels long but I've had one of my deliveries I've got another one coming I'm hoping it comes within the next half hour because otherwise my dad's going to have to get it but I ordered something because I really wanted the new cover of this so I ordered um, a book from Blackwell's because they had the new cover um, it's not it's not as shiny as I expected. It's like a bit, it's a bit damaged at the back. But I bought a lot of other words by Christina Lauren. I've been wanting this book for ages, but I did not like the UK cover. So I'm really happy with this. So I can add this to my little shelf. 
Um, I'm filming a video later, I think. I'm trying to do this myself for after work. I want to film a video, a TV after the rest of the year. I've got a lot of books, but it's not going to be every book on here because I'm not going to get through them. I've got like so many, but I'm just going to choose like some books I want to read this year, like ones I really want to read. But yeah, so I'm very happy with this. I have got 25 minutes, so I'm going to go get coffee. I just. Oh, I don't want to use my coffee pods up because I can't go to Safers yet and get some more until I'm obviously tested negative. So, hoping tomorrow I'll test negative so I can go into town and get some. But I'm going to try and tidy my room up, my floor up now whilst I've got time and then, yeah. Okay, it's like 25 to 7, I've got food in the oven finished work I filmed a video so I'm pretty proud of myself but I think I'm just going to spend the evening chilling and reading um both um Bridgerton and Seven Husbands Evelyn Hugo because I was the only one to annotate it because I just don't feel like being on my computer tonight and so I'm not going to try and force myself to edit because obviously I'm just not going to pay attention I'm just going to sit there so I'm going to just I need to put all this back because I filmed this for my August TBR, not August TBR, my TBR for the rest of the year. Um, so I need to put it back so that I can sit on my bed and just chill. I've got Danny's house on at the moment whilst my food is cooking, but I'll probably put my pajamas on a bit later. I was watching that during work, um, and I was, I, I've been it's been fine apart from the one episode that made me cry when Bonnie's grams died. So. But we're nearly at the end of season two, season one, which is all, and I just like, oh, it's crazy, but I'm obsessed. Absolutely obsessed. But yeah, I'm really excited just to sit and read tonight, to be honest, but yeah. Um, I also need to finish trying to rest of my room, but I'll do it tomorrow. In my, one of my half hour breaks, probably my second one, because I'll probably have a later lunch tomorrow, so yeah. Also, one good thing happened today, I smashed the stats this last week with doing the most interactions, and I got a phone call from my manager just to make just to congratulate me, I was like, so sweet. Oh, yeah. So, I'm going to go now. Good morning, hello, it is Tuesday the 9th of August, it is 10, no, it's literally three minutes to nine, I've got three minutes before I start work. Um, it's my second to last day of working from home because I'm tested negative. I did take a test last night. It came back, well, it came back negative in the first half hour. And 15 minutes later, there was like the faintest, faintest line. Took another test this morning and it's completely negative. It's completely negative. And I've obviously got to take another one tomorrow. But it makes me so happy because it means I can go back to my, my I can get my, I can go back to work on Thursday. And I can go to the Heathers on Saturday and not worry. My plan for Saturday, I'm thinking of waiting around afterwards to see if I can get photos, like stage door photos. But again, I know it gets really busy with the Heathers waiting, waiting around and I just got to take my trains. So I'm gonna, I'm considering it. To be fair, if I buy a travel card, then I should be fine. Well, I'll figure it out for Saturday. Anyway, I'm gonna stop talking now. Well, I'm not stop talking now. I'm literally gonna do some work. I'll go to work, obviously, in two minutes. I'm right to do this and I'm really going to try and get it done. I do want to head to town now after work because I want to get some more coffee pots. But I might. And it would be nice to get a bit of fresh air. So I think after work I'm going to go to town, get some coffee pots. If works is still open, go to work because I want to have a look. And then I'm just going to come home and I want to try and edit the video and do some stuff. But yeah. Anyway, I've got one minute. I'm, I'm still in pyjamas, I'll get changed at some point. Hello, okay, it's a bit later now, just bear with me one moment. <sighs> I'm going to probably show you this in a minute. I'm going to talk quickly. Um, I just went to town because I needed to get some food. And I'm, I'm negative, so I thought I might as well go out after work. I wanted to go to the works because I have an addiction to buying books, but I'll show you them in a moment. Um, but one good thing about working from home has been I have got through. I'm on season two, episode five of the Vampire Diaries, um, and I'm obsessed. I've forgotten how much I love it because I used to watch it, but I would skim through to the ones the episodes I like and would ignore the rest of it. 
Um, but I really just wanted to rewatch it fully, no matter what, even though I don't like some of the episodes. Um, but it reminds me, it, I just love the story. I just love it. Um, so yeah, but I wanted to show you this book properly because I quickly showed you my lunch break when I told you about me going to see Greece on Saturday and I'm very excited. But I bought this from um, TikTok shop on Louise um, and it's literally, I'm a goal getter and it's got like, you can do goals, you do reflections, you do intentions and I absolutely love it. And it's just like a nice little reflection thing and I was doing so well at like doing stuff like this at the beginning of the year and I stopped and I know this is massive, like this is a thousand like, pages. But I absolutely love it. I think it's so cool. And I think I like the um, idea of it. And I can't wait just to start like doing it. I might do it a bit later. But I'm actually going to try and edit the vlog today. I feel a bit more awake. I'm going to probably get a cup of tea or something after dinner. Um, depending on how I feel. Because I've had a milkshake. I've got a milkshake. So I'm right, but, um, and just try and get on some editing. Because I do want to edit that reading vlog. I want to get it up as soon as possible. So yeah, um, with the um, book, the lip oil came as well, and I actually really like it. Like my lips still feel moisturised, and it's been on since about I want to say half past twelve, so nearly six hours, pretty good. So yeah, this is um, I got it from TikTok Shop, which was cheaper than it would have really been. I don't know if it's still on TikTok Shop, um, because yeah, but I I did buy three books but I need I made I not made a decision but I promised myself that I'm not gonna spend much more money no not much more I'm not gonna buy it try and promise myself and I'm making a deal because I'm not gonna buy any more books the rest of this year because I need to save and I really need to put money in my savings and I need to keep it and I so when I get paid at the end of this month and this month most of it all of it basically is going in my savings it's probably come like two hundred pounds to like, get food and snacks like or lunches and stuff. So yeah because i also want to take my mum to the ivy for dinner ivy asia in london i think for dinner on her birthday even though we've got to get from there to we can do like an early dinner but we'll see i have i'm gonna to have to have a look um at prices and stuff and see if i can really justify it because if not then no but yeah i'm very excited um so i bought three books from the works you can already see which one the first one is probably yeah um, first one i bought was the spanish love deception for five pound this has been incredibly hyped up on tiktok and i told myself i'm not gonna get it it's not a big deal but i feel like i need to read it at some point and if i don't right now then i'm probably never gonna read it and i was like i need to read it if um I've heard like very much mixed reviews, some people really didn't like it, some people did and I'm just like I need to find out for myself because I'm a firm believer that someone, that just because someone else doesn't like it, like someone you follow doesn't like it doesn't mean you, I won't. So I got that, I then bought a, a British with love, um, which I've seen on TikTok but not much about it but it was £3 in um, works so I had to get it, it seems pretty short so it doesn't seem too bad and I can't wait to give it um, a read, I don't know why I don't take these off but I kind of feel like I need to because it looks like a pretty cover oh. and then I got the cheat sheet by Sarah Adams, again I've heard some good things about this on YouTube and TikTok and BookTok, but I um, don't, I know I've had some not great things about it. So I need to give it a read. This is a, a friend's to love as well as sound of it. So this is going on my book pile. Hello, I really hope you can see me because I've put you on my bed. I'm so tired. I have actually not DN, well, I have DNF'd it. I have DNF'd Bridgerton, the Duke and I, for now. I I'm not saying I don't like it, I just found the TV show better. I think if I had read it before the TV show, maybe it would be different, but because I've watched the series, it's just a weird, different feeling for me. But I, I will get back into it, I will get to it at some point. I just, 
I don't think I should have started reading it when I did because I'm just not interested in the book right now. So I am going to start rereading the Girl Online series now because I really want to. But I'm not going to do it for a video. I'm just going to like read it, start reading it and put it in the vlog, do it like talk about it in vlogs. So let's see how cringed I get by this because I can already feel myself cringing just by looking at the first page. Um, so let's do this. Um yeah i'll probably read a few chapters of this and then do some seven and a half seven husbands of evelyn hugo because i want to annotate it i did i did manage to annotate it to read a chapter of that whilst at work today because um it had a moment when there was no emails and no calls coming through and i didn't have anything else to do apart from watch vampire diaries and yeah i had to stop watching that now because it's making me cry and i just really need to not cry right now and i'm very tired so got miranda on gonna read and I will chat to you probably tomorrow. I don't know what tomorrow's going to entail with my last, well, I say last day, let's pray that the last test I take tomorrow is also negative like today's was, because I will not be happy if it's not, because I really, 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 really want to go back to the office. I am done with working at home. I only did three days last week working at home, so I'm only done six days by the end of this, by tomorrow from working at home because I had Thursday and Friday off but if I wasn't working Thursday I was working Thursday and Friday I think I'd be more insane I just miss it's the atmosphere of being in the office like yes leaving my house sounds like a lot of effort but it's the atmosphere of being in the office with everyone I just miss it but anyway I'm gonna read now I'll speak to you tomorrow good morning it is wednesday the 10th of august it is my last day working from home and i have mixed feelings well not mixed feelings really the 90 percent i'm very excited to go back to the office i miss it 10 percent i am gonna miss watching tv whilst working i'm gonna miss watching the vampire diaries whilst working um but i am very excited to get back to the office i feel very like at home i get very monotonous and like the day just once the day's finished i just don't feel super tired and don't want to do anything else. I usually feel like that after work anyway, but I feel like a lot more like I don't want to do anything because I've literally been in this room all day. Um, and I still need to turn this floor. I've got a bin bag half full and it's not done. So maybe I'll try and do that my lunch break today. We'll see what happens. My expert is really playing up. I finished doing this cappuccino I made. I, got, I bought cappuccino pods yesterday for my coffee machine. So I'm just you know drinking that i've got 15 minutes before i start work so i'm just kind of chilling watching some youtube trying to wake myself up a little bit before work starts um and then after work my plan is to try and finish editing this vlog of the vlog video but it depends how i feel i'm gonna try and set my computer back up on my desk so maybe that will help because then i could just use the monitor um so but as well, so after work I need to unplug all this um, because I'm going to have to move this phone off because I don't want it on there because I want to be able to sort that back so I'm going to sort myself out and I'm going to try and edit the video um, and just read some girl online I read two chapters yesterday I was too tired to um, read anymore but I read two chapters and I, I'm <laughs> it's very cringy but it's good I, I forgot, I've, I've forgotten what it is about. To be fair, I've forgotten what happens. I know roughly, but I've forgotten what happens, so... Yeah. Anyway, I'm going to finish watching this video. There's like five minutes left of it. And then I think... I don't know what I'm going to do before I start work. I just I might just do my hair, because... I don't know. If it's going to feel very weird going back to the office tomorrow after being away from it for like a week and a half... Um, but I'm very excited to get back into the office and to see everyone. <sighs> Never thought I'd miss the office as much as I have. Standing in the cold, cold rain, I don't even feel the pain. Anything to step away. I know we could both do better so It is Friday the 12th of August It is currently 20 to 7 
I had to take a nap when I got home from work because oh my god the heat it's not even that hot in the office but I didn't sleep very well last night anyway and then the heat walking home oh my god it's so tiring it's the point where I just got across the road and got a slushy there's heaven and if I have money to I might buy myself a slushy at the um theatre tomorrow an alcoholic one no uh, heathers it depends how I'm feeling in the evening um so yeah tomorrow's London day it's gonna be super hot tomorrow so I'm kind of dreading it I'm gonna wear a dress because then it means like it's just one thing and it's not too much I just don't know what dress I'm wearing yet I need to have a look through but I've got time tomorrow but I am still going early-ish because I'm gonna have to walk to top, probably probably walk to Tottenham Road station area to get to Greece because their tubes are on strike. I don't mind the walking part because it's nice weather tomorrow anyway even though it's going to be hot. I also don't mind the walking part because it's London, it's not about it's not about to walk it. It's just, I, it depends how I'm feeling like tomorrow, it depends on the tubes and how I'm feeling because the tubes are also going to be gross and sticky, I don't know if I want to do that. So yeah, I'm going to try my hardest to vlog some bits tomorrow whilst I'm in London because you know it, it'll be a good part of the vlog and it'll be nice to end the vlog from working from home to being in London um it's been nice being back in the office the last couple of days I did a vlog yesterday because I woke up got ready went to work it was a really weird but fun happy experience being back in the office and then I did work obviously and then I came I went to my friends and so I didn't really vlog but I didn't vlog at all yesterday but going back to the office was great it felt nice being back in the office after so long being off um and then today I was obviously in the office and it was also nice being in the office again. So yeah, um, I'm now going to try to spend my evening just finishing this vlog and get it up. I also want to start doing a marketing portfolio. I think I'm going to use Wix to do that. Um, so I probably won't do much of that today because I'm not going to do much tonight. But probably Sunday is when I'm going to do it. Sunday I'm going to have like a real productive just get on with editing stuff, get on with doing stuff and actually be productive. So that's the plan. Um... Right now, gonna edit this vlog, gonna drink my slushy. I wasn't gonna get one, but I saw a TikTok of someone with this uh, slushy. I was like, oh, I can really do a slushy right now. So I just got one mixed with all the colours. It looks like the heaven's colours, your blue, red, and green. Well, this one it kind of looks like yellow, so. It's like the heaven's colours. So, not complaining. But anyway, I'm gonna stop talking now. I'm gonna go. I'll catch up. Good morning, it's currently 10 past 10 on the 13th of August. I'm actually about to get ready to leave because, well not get ready to leave, I'm not leaving till like 11. My train's at 11.37 as long as the trains are okay because I should really be keeping an eye on that because, you know, we all know what British transport is like. Um, at the moment, especially in this weather and... Um, the Peterborough trains are getting cancelled which is not looking great but at least my train isn't um, my train is at 11.37 so should be okay um, I'm very excited I'm going to see Greece I've already pre-ordered my drink to get there I'm literally just ordered water I'm not drinking like alcohol um, and then I ordered an ice cream for the interval because it's hung and doesn't have strawberry cheesecake I can't say no and you know it just made it a lot easier than trying to like stand in the queue but I will need to buy a program because it's Greece. I need to sort my bag out which I'll do in a moment. I did just have a mini panic because I, I needed to pay my second part of my Jordan Luke Ghost tickets off and I completely forgot about it and yeah managed to I, I was able to which is good. But yeah I'm excited to go today take a day out I will try my hardest to vlog I need to figure out what I'm wearing because this heat is gonna be insane I'm probably just gonna wear a dress um I think I'm gonna wear a dress I wore for graduation last year because it's gonna chill it's gonna be high as 33 today I'm not entirely looking forward to it but it's fine it is fine we will be fine Um, but 
yeah I really I feel like I've got myself into a reading slump like I haven't wanted to read all week like I'm trying to read this book and I just can't be bothered and I don't know if it's just because I don't want to read the girl online books now after like saying that or if I'm just not feeling like reading so I'm thinking I'm gonna think about it over today and then I might refill my TBR for the rest of the year because I might take them off and just start reading like other books we're gonna see anyway I'm gonna sort myself out watch this video pack my bags and charge my phone once I do that because I, I got hooked on a TikTok seriously earlier and yeah it was a distraction that I didn't need I made the decision not to read any more of the Girl Online books. I'm going to refill my rest of the year TBR tomorrow morning before, so I can edit it tomorrow to get it up for some point next week. My reading vlog went up last night. I actually need to promote it still because I haven't done that yet, so I'll do that in a bit. Um, but I've decided to read Archer's Voice because I've heard so many good things about it and just thought maybe I've heard it. If you like Colin Who, you'll like this book. So I'm hoping it's going to be good. I'm going to take it with me to start reading on the train because as long as the trains don't mess up, I've got a journey ahead of me. So it'll be nice. And like, you know what I think is what I can do when I'm just chilling after the theatre or before the delay, I can find someone to sit and just read. Wish you would have left me here. Now I'm just controlled by fear. What's the point in our reflection if you never look in the mirror? Counting the days until you're gone Waiting for us to carry on Oh, I'm running, what am I running from? Time's going by, but where's the time going? I tried to give you everything You took it all and took it for granted If you're still falling out of love Maybe it's cause it's not enough So I'm just going to put them in. Um, I've got the Grease Mega Mix for how to film it, so I'm probably going to put that in. But I'm going to end the vlog here. Um, if you did enjoy it, please give it a thumbs up. Please comment down below. Please subscribe. And I will see you again very soon with another weekly vlog. Mm -hmm.